it is 85 degrees here in Florida and it's been that way for the last two weeks. Treat myself to something to eat because it's in walking distance. This dress has the most beautiful print. I just love it. And I put it on with my metallic converse. out to lunch uh i went and because we have a chili's i went to chili's we have a chili's like right down the street for me and i had a nice little walk there i sat down at the bar and i had the food it was just meant when your meal is delicious and everything tasted good and your drink was delicious and you could just get up and walk home. First, I went to Walmart, got my lottery. Grandma trying to retire, okay? I, I need a lottery money to retire. Went and got my lottery, and I enjoyed that lunch. I did. Um, I know in the last video, I said I was going to show you what I got. Uh, that I ordered then I noticed there was just a lot of little teeny things but on my next video I promise you it's going to be I'm going to either make a meal for you or I'm going to show you some of the new uh vegan stuff I didn't try because you know I'd be uh if those who knew I am a pescatarian which means I don't eat meat but I do eat seafood I do eat mostly as fish um but i try to be healthy and sometimes that's incorporating vegan where sometimes i just eat vegan all the time i don't eat no dairy i don't eat none of that i just eat vegan i, I try to do it like once a week out of a month so i find little vegan snacks which is the snacks that i try to stick to um and i will show you some of those things so since you can't see me open no packages and i don't go shopping I got to keep you entertained. This is my end of winter looks. Every year I do my end of winter looks. Looks that I put together but I never wore. Um, not for any particular reason. It's just that I just didn't wear it. So I always do this. Um, so if you follow me, you'll know this. So uh, for all the new people, if there's new people that have joined, my name is Danita, I am age is how you wear it, which means no matter what you wear, your age does not define anything you wear. Whether you like my looks and you're younger or you're older and you think, oh, should I dress this way because of my age? Age is how you wear it because there's some young women, honey, that don't look, they, now they look a little rough, look a little rough around the edges. So. That is why I say it. And it's all about transformation. That is why I call you my butterflies. Because if you want to join the butterflies, it means no matter where you're at in the transformation, caterpillar to butterfly, baby, always know your value and that you are beautiful. So, since I'm burning up in here, I had to turn my AC all the way up because these are winter looks and I couldn't go outside because I would have fainted. Do you want me to faint? Can anybody help me? I live alone. I'm by myself. I take all this by myself. Um, so, I'm going to take one thing out of the look, talk about the look, and I will not keep you. I have on my Skims bodysuit and review about Skims. Yes. I can wear that bodysuit without a bra. And grandma's stuff ain't perky i ain't had no surgery to make nothing perky i can wear the skims bodysuit without a bra and feel very comfortable 
So yes, it is worth it. And I probably will get me so whenever it go on sale again, cause I only got it when it was like $10 off. I think that's the lowest I've ever seen it go. I will buy another one when it's at that price. But let's talk about this faux fur. Now, let animal print of any kind is never going nowhere. You can have that as a staple in your closet, honey, and it will not go anywhere. So, I got this one thrifted, of course. Uh, look at this. Isn't it nice? It's cropped. Um, it zips. But I like having it open. Uh, but I am going to take a... You will see a picture with this on um, probably before you even see this video. Uh, styling it with the same hair and everything because I think this is a beautiful look when it's closed up and up close kind of picture so yes this here and i got on camouflage jeans um and i thought that just looked so nice the red cropped leather fringe vintage jacket this is everything and it's red it's an Evan Todd. Um, like I said, it's that Western vintage uh, leather. So nice. So nice. And I just wanted to pair it with all black. I wanted the, the jacket to be the focal point. Because at first, I was going to wear it with red boots. But then I was like, I don't want matchy matchy. I don't want to wear it matchy. I want just an all black look. And I, yeah, I think I put it with the black uh, fedora, having that Western look to it. So yes, this here, and I just, it's, and you can, I'm telling you the fringe, you could tell that this is vintage because it's like already, um, it just look vintage like it look has that old look to it that worn look that makes it just everything never leaving my closet that and that other next. one <laughs> next you see this honey 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 let me just let you see it up close the fringe on the pockets this is definitely, um, you know, I want to say Western, but then I want to say like, um, not West. I want to say like, as if like the Indian patterns, Indians were not cowboy and you know, they weren't Western, you know? So I, this is what that looks like to me. It has that, uh, um, feel of native um you know native that native look and the stitching and you see i had it on with that yellow dress because i want to put the blue is so dark and rich so i really wanted you to see this and yes this is also vintage with wow. this um trench coat now, my green dress I got from, let me see, H&M. I've worn it, but I rarely have worn this trench coat. I think I may have taken a picture in it once. It's from ASOS. What I love is the exaggerated sleeves, and I tied it in the back, and it goes all the way down. You see how long it is, um, and it has the of course trench lord what i'm doing jesus it has the trench look with the trench coat part right here um i'm really thinking about getting this shortened i want to so bad we'll see the pictures after this of these looks on instagram i figured i'd bring it here first let you look at it talk about it and then 
let you uh, see it so that you have something to see before I put it on Instagram. Which you know you got to put every look on Instagram. Okay, so the last look is this black and I mean this gray coat with the black um, what is that? Velour trim collar. This is also a vintage David Benjamin coat. This is actually 100% cotton. Do you believe that? I would not have thought this was 100% cotton. And I love the gold buttons on it. See the gold buttons? I love the gold buttons on it. Uh, even though my bag had silver in it, you really couldn't tell. And I don't care about mixing metals. And the silver with gray doesn't even matter. But this is a beautiful, beautiful vintage um, gray coat. And gray is beautiful. And um, I decided to dress it down. So I wore it with my white... Uh, let me see what which jeans they are, these are. Because I know you've seen me in these jeans before. These are the free people jeans. Um, I decided to wear it with that and that gray uh, bodysuit, which I think I wore that gray bodysuit. I've had it for years. Twice. I don't, I don't really, I need to start with. All this stuff, guys, you know I'm on a no buy till June. Everything you're going to see on videos going forward to June, past June, I have in my closet. I have so many things that you haven't even seen. And shopping my closet has been amazing. I forgot I had this clutch where you can hold it like this or like this. I got it from the in, in the thrift store. And this clutch, I had three of them, but this is the one I kept because I thought this one was just different. I love this. And I have, I'm, I just got to wear my stuff, guys. All right. I'm glad you stayed for the devotion. All right. So the title of the devotion is One Voice. Sometimes we got too many people talking to us. One voice. May the God of endurance and encouragement grant you to live in such harmony with one another in accord with Christ Jesus, that together you may be with one voice, glorify the God. So it says, by God's grace, we press on. <laughs> this life is wrought with difficulties and our own perseverance will in our own perseverance will at some point expire you get tired honey you get tired god's grace has no end he will always offer us the endurance and encouragement we need often god's mode of com communication is through other believers so so this is why i say if you don't do devotion all the time or you do your devotion at home because you know you're supposed to go to church and fellowship with others but we're not gonna get into that so what i what i'm doing is i am fellowship fellowshipping with other believers so if you are a believer or new and want to then i'm nowhere near no pastor no no minister nothing like that i'm just a person loving god and reading his word but i am supposed to um be a part of you could say be a part of the the branch of the tree i'm supposed i you know we all are branches connected and and this way we as believers can connect you stay and we talk about the devotion so uh this is one more reason why it is so vital that we live harmoniously together pursuing peace and having grace just like when we're singing a song with others we each have our own part but we blend 
We each have our own part, but we blend our voices together to make a wonderful song. So, guys, join me for my devotion at the end. That way we connect. Okay? All right, guys. Thank you for joining. Like, subscribe, hit all the buttons. Bye, guys.